hello how you doing Kari Toje here so today I'm here just to get you my clients updates of what's going on the last time I was here to get updates was just two weeks ago I tried to keep up with this because a lot of you invested here so it was just two weeks ago and I started seeing colleagues um, videos from colleagues realizing that a few things have changed since the last time I was here so I said I should come get this video just for you people today so I'm at um, beachfront phase two yeah that's the signboard so I'm going to turn the camera and show you the few changes that has happened if you have not seen any um, update before this is your first time as the opportunity for you to know what's going on here our location is going to start sometime next year that of phase one is going to start um in february 2020 2021 so this one i'm sure is going to start maybe march or second quarter not sure yet but definitely next year location will be happening here and everything we're doing here is in preparation for that so i'll turn the camera and show you the what's the update of this place right now so look at it so much sand here and so much bricks i'm sure they want to use um for the interlocking for my colleagues and here and interested people who want to buy as well so sand is blocking everywhere we're not trying to find a way to okay i think there's a corner here i can take so so you see um just two days ago landmark launched the avocado um, smart homes and some of you i don't know probably would have been worried that oh, these people just launching estate hope they're not going to abandon that's one thing about landmark they never i have not seen any of landmarks um, um project that was you know abandoned so so you see it the painting has, has been done now which was was not the case the last time i was here and um some of you are asking has it not sold out why is it not sold out it's not fast selling why are people not buying it? they're just laughing they're like people are buying it's just that see it, i love this color it's just that they added more plots so and you know the phase one sold out like you know like wildfire and um the phase two now um i didn't want them to come up with a phase three because you know like too much of everything is bad it's like once beach run beach run beach run beach run you know so i think they also thought of that and they wanted to just conclude it at phase two so instead of bringing phase phase um theory they decided to add more plots here so that's why it's still but trust me is the fastest selling estate that we have in my portfolio in general is the fastest selling estate that we have this phase two so okay so look at it clearing is being done now so where i just came in from that's the exit when you're driving now let me show you stand properly and show you so that's the entrance so you drive in like this and you go that way you go you go this way now this is the drive out the exit See? so right now if you look at this place now clearing has started and um, they are going to sand fill before they allocate so after clearing i'm sure they'll do some dredging and then they'll start to you know to sand fill the place um the stage where they are now is clearing we see same thing they are doing for phase one as well and i'm going to go to phase one and bring that of course phase one has sold out so i'm just doing that for just for my clients to see and for those who still want to invest in phase two because phase two has limited plots i'm sure for those who still want to invest in phase two you know that you know the projects are going on side by side you know concurrently none is being being abandoned let me zoom in so you see as far back set so some place obviously has some water but other than the water 
Let me zoom out. Yeah. But other than the water, this place is low. It's lower than, you know, much lower than the road. So either way, it still has to be sanitary, whether there's water or there's no water. So that's it. That's it for the update of phase two. Um, for a more detailed video, you can check my previous videos. Um, my previous videos on um, beach from phase two. If you still want to acquire more plots, um, you still have the opportunity to do that. Even if you've invested before, now that is looking is coming together because some of you invested when you still had doubts, you know. And I always tell people that this is like for the range of three million naira plot of land. This is the best we have. It's not um, for any. Um, I don't have any conflict of interest, so it's not for because any estate you want to buy, you still you still patronize me, right? So this is not. There's no particular reason I will be recommending this. I will be telling you it's the best right now. If it wasn't the best, this is the best right now that we have for the price range, because of a lot of things going for it. The coastal road where it is on leads to Victoria Island, leads to Ogombo Road, and then from the Lekki Expressway there are shortcuts that way you don't have to take a liquor. There are two access roads from the Lekki Ekpe Expressway that leads to this place that is way shorter you know because when we come through Eleko it's like we are still driving back it's like we've driven all the way to Eleko from the Lekki Ekpe Expressway and then we come back here we drive down again so it's like driving back twice you know so we are doing that Lekki Ekpe Expressway twice which is not going to always be like that um, the access roads are already there it's just that right now they are not you know accessible they've not you know not worked on it yet that in a way that people could drive so this is it so let me go out I'm going to add to that of phase one and see what stage they currently are in terms of development <laughs> So all this, all this space you see, and this long is going to be a driving, you know, well crafted driving, which is why I kind of like phase two more than phase one. If I have to choose, just because this one they moved far away, you know, from the from the coastal road. This one really entered; they pushed it inside more than the phase one. This one has more space, which is if I had to pick. Aside the fact that it is five minutes, it is at least five minutes drive closer, <laughs> you know. So that's it for this one. Hello again, Kari Toje here. So I'm here at Beach from Phase 1 people because when I bring the update of Phase 2, those who've invested in Phase 1 are always like, ah, what about us that bought in Phase 1? You've forgotten us now. I can never do that. So I'm here in Beach from Phase 1. Can you see it? Can you see it? I'm going to show you properly, properly how that's going. Um, they're already placing the interlock uh, at the driving. So I'm going to turn the camera now. I'm excited. I'm excited. This is where phase two is going as well. Phase two, of course, phase one started before phase two. So it's normal that this would have progressed a bit more than phase two. So I'll just turn the camera now and show you what we have here, what has been happening so far. So is it so the stage where they are at now is placing the, the interlock the interlocking they're doing the interlocking of the driveway you see when i said landmark doesn't have any abandoned projects they don't you know they are working on a number of estates concurrently search so yeah Set. oh wow none with the interlocking this thing is looking like it's really pushed inside you know i was telling you that but phase two is still more inside than this like more pushed inside from the road but this is not bad at all i mean look at it 
Okay, so. So this is where we are added with phase two. Of course, that thing you saw at phase two, this is what they intend to put there, the name of the estate. So you see, I don't bring you something bad. I never bring you something bad. So when I always say beachfront is really the best we have right now at that price range, I know what I'm talking about. And Landmark is really, uh, that's it, that's their look. Landmark is really the one of the best to work with uh, when you're expecting a developer that will deliver, you know. I'm very proud of that company, to be honest. So... Last time I was after, here. After you buy, come okay. For, Last time I was here, clearing, clearing has not gotten all the way to that side. Very, very so, see? More clearing. What I noticed, because the last time I was just here, the last update I did was just two weeks ago. So, that's what I'm noticing that a little more clearing has been done. So we are preparing for February, February 2021 um, allocation. So if you've not paid for your development levy and your survey and your deed, this is the time to pay for it if you want to be among the first batches um, of people to be allocated the first batch rather of people to be allocated you need to because those fees have to be cleared and if you start it now you don't have to pay it at once and if you start early because your deed of assignment your survey especially will take about two months to be out because it will be a register survey it will need to be lodged at um, allow sir for them to register it you know so and that takes a minimum of six weeks sometimes two months so you want to pay for that because all those documents have to be ready before you can legally own a land they are document required by the government so if you've not paid pay so that your allocation can you know you can be among the first batch you know for allocation wow let me zoom in i cannot see how houses that are far far down because the clearing has gone so far carry can you see those houses there house is down 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 i can see that when this place launched um well just august just in august we could not see you know everywhere was still just the way it was launched so yeah so that's it hope you appreciate the updates uh, so before i bring you another update will probably be in january this will likely be the last update i do here so that next time when i bring you another update there will be you know some difference inside the estate in terms of maybe dredging and sand filling so that's it thank you so much for watching like i said this place of course is sold out but if this motivates you and what's going on if it's to motivate you to buy more plot even though you've invested before before because i know a lot of you have invested already a lot of you my followers a lot of you my clients have invested here already but you know i have between the two estates i have six plots so if you've not bought up to six then definitely there's still room for you to to buy more plots you know because i understand why some of you want to you know want to separate your investment because some people say i don't want to put everything in one place why that is valid you separating your investment doesn't exactly mean that it will work better for you because you could end up just buying buying two different estates in two different places that nothing happens in do you get or you run into trouble and then the estate the other one you buy it doesn't have doesn't have um, a title you realize later so once you find one you know and you know it's a good way in terms of location in terms of that title and everything you just buy as many as you can buy much later down the road you have more money you can buy in other places so, so that's it um that place leads to the beach but we've done all that too many times that i'm not going to be going to the beach again today so that's this update for this one until next year before coming away again with an update of um beach from phase one
you know maybe phase two i'll see maybe do one more this year i don't know if because we keep i keep getting clients that come for inspection so if something brings me here and we'll still see another update for beachfront if i feel that enough has changed for me to record so all right then eh? until i come your way again this is carrie today i'll be expecting that call so call me and i'll be glad to take your call bye for now